Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial, we are going to learn about uh, check boxes in Java or J check boxes in Java. So let's start. So this is uh, the code from our previous tutorial. So I'll come to this project and create a new file here in this new Java file, and I will name this uh, check boxes java and now I'll click finish to create this file now the file is created and we have a man method inside this so I'll remove this, these comments and this as well now I'll create a constructor here public check boxes java and now i'll put parentheses and then curly braces now we have created this we have misspelled this i think so i'll rename this to uh, check boxes and rename this now it is okay so first we will create a j frame so j frame frame equals new j frame and I'll put semicolon now I have to import this so I'll click on this and import this now j frame is imported now we have to add bounds to this or size to this so frame dot set bounds And now here I will pass in uh, 0 comma 0 and comma uh, 500 the width and 500 the height and I'll put semicolon here now we will use frame dot set default and control space close operation and now here I will use J frame dot uh, exit on close and uh, now now we will cre create a container so container container equals uh, frame dot get content pen now we have all the content of this j frame into this uh, uh, container and now I will add set a layout to this uh, container so I'll dot set layout and uh, I will pass null here for now we will use null layout and now let me scroll down a bit to make some space and now we will make this uh, j a frame visible so frame dot set visible and true now if i run this so nothing is showing up because we haven't called this uh, checkbox class in our main method so i'll call it here check box is control space and enter uh, check boxes equals new check control space and boxes and now i'll put semicolon here now if i run this now you can see a frame on your screen now i'll close this and now we will add a j label here so j label label equals new j label and now here i will pass in select your scales and i will put semicolons as a semicolon and now we will set bounds to this label so label and first i have to import this so i'll add import and uh, label dot set bounds and uh, now i'll 
provide here some bounds so I'll give it a hundred from left so it will take a hundred from left uh, and I'll give it a uh, 20 from top and I will give a width of 100 and uh, a height of 30 and now I'll add it to the container so container dot add and now I'll use a label and now I'll put semicolon here now if I run this now you will see that this will be shown this J label will be shown on the frame now you can see select your skills here now I'll close here it and now we will add some checkboxes so I'll use J check box uh, check box equals new J control space and checkbox and now I'll uh, put semicolon and now I'll uh, give it a uh, name of uh, select yeah uh, or I will give it all and then uh, J check box check box 2 equal new j check box and here I will give it um, java semicolon now I will copy this I have to change this to capital B and now I will copy this Control C this and now Control V this. Now I'll make this uh, Python and I'll change this to uh, uh, Flutter and uh, now I'll make this uh, checkbox 3 and this one uh, checkbox 4 and uh, I think that's enough. Now we will uh, set bounds for all of them. So check box dot set uh, bounds and uh, so from uh, on x axis I will give it uh, 120 on y axis I will give it uh, 50 and uh, I'll give it a width of uh, 100. 100 and a height of 30 so now I'll copy this control C this and now I'll paste it here and paste it again and again because we have four check boxes so now I'll make this um, 120 and uh, I'll make this uh, 90 and uh, I'll make this uh, 130 is enough and it will also be on 120 and this will become uh, 130 and this will become 170 and now I'll add it into the container so for that I'll make this two, this uh, one three, and this one four. Now I will add all of them into the container. So container dot add, and now I'll pass in check box semicolon, and now I'll copy this. And I will paste it, paste it again and again. Now I'll make this uh, two, this one three, and this one four. Now if I run this, 
and file now you can see we have four checkboxes checkbox one two three and four now uh, with this if we select this all so all will be selected at once and uh, if we select a single then a single will be selected so for that functionality I will come here and now I'll uh, implement action listener so I'll use here implements action listener and now I'll import this and now I'll uh, implement all abstract methods so now if I go down so this action perform method is implemented here but that this this will not work until we add uh, action listener to each of these checkboxes so checkbox dot add action listener and this now I'll copy this copy this and now I'll control V it here control V it here control V it here now um, I'll make this two two this one three and this one four so now we have added now we will write some code here so I'll uh, comment this and I'll make some space here and now here if check org zero dot git source equals equals uh, checkbox so this checkbox is not uh, accessible here because we haven't created it uh, globally so I'll uh, copy this from here control C this and now I'll go to the top and control V it here and now I'll make this uh, check box 2 comma check box 3 comma check box 4 semicolon and now I'll remove these check boxes from here this one I'll backspace this as well this as well and this as well now everything is okay now it is accessible here down here so here I will use uh, curly braces and now I'll use uh, I'll create another label so for that control this this and uh, for that I will come here to the top I'll copy this label this J label and I'll copy it up to here and to see this and uh, I'll come here and now I'll control V it here I'll make this J label 2 2 2 2 and now on Y axis I'll make this one or two hundred okay and I'll make this this one I will make two so now if I run this so I'll change this uh, text as well so I'll come here and I will remove this and now I'll use selected skill is and now here we will add the scale so for that I will come here down now 
for checkbox one we have to select all so I'll come down F I'll copy this control C this and I will remove this and control V it a bit a few times V and control V now I'll make this uh, two this three this four and now I'll make this uh, label also global this label two so I'll copy this from here Control C because we have to access it in the action perform method so I'll make it global and I'll semicolon and now I'll come here and I will remove this from here now it is okay so I'll go down and now here I will use a label uh, to dot set text and here I will pass in uh, selected scale is and now here I will pass in plus um, check box for dot get text and now I'll copy this Control C this and now I'll control V it here. Control V it here. And uh, this is uh, checkbox 3. This checkbox 2. And now I'll use control V it here. And selected skill is uh, checkbox this one. And I will use here plus. Uh, checkbox dot get text um, plus checkbox uh, two dot get uh, text and plus checkbox uh, three dot get text and now if I run this now our code is complete so if I run this now if I select this now here this is not showing up so I'll increase its size so I'll go here and uh, go here and I'll make this uh, its uh, width uh, 300 and now if I run this again I run this file so if I select this so you can see that selected scale is Java selected scale is Python and selected scale is Flutter so it changes when I select this now when I select this so it will show all of them here Java Python, Flutter and all but uh, these are not uh, checked so for that I will come here and I uh, will use uh, here check box to dot uh, set selected true and I uh, will copy this Control C this and now or Control V this and Control V this I will make this uh, 3 and this one as 4 now it is complete so if I run the file and now if I select this so you can see all the checkboxes all the select, uh, selected and all the scales are shown here so i think that's all for today i hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you